Um, Mosin asks, what's your advice for new painters? For what? New painters. New painters? Mm, I guess people getting into painting. Well, if somebody was going to go to art school and ask would I, what advice I would have, I would say learn as many skills as you can, but really, really focus on drawing. But what if they're not going to art school? What if it's just anybody who's decided that they're, they want to start painting? Well, it's the same as if you wanted to learn to play guitar or anything. You really, really have to put in the time. That's what it's all about. You have to put in the time. Get yourself a good teacher if you can, but whether you do or you don't, you have to put in the time. And a lot of time, sadly, it takes a lot of time. Uh, and it should be worth it. And I would say as well, like I, um, I've been doing a few different jobs, but not much kind of just sketching for fun and I did a bit today and I think what you've got to allow yourself to do is not be great necessarily at the beginning and I could find myself editing what I was doing and judging it before I'd even had a chance to start enjoying it yeah, so I, I think I agree with that you've got to just let yourself muck about and not stop because your inner voice is saying it's not good enough just keep pressing through that and it will come out on the other side, usually. Yeah, that inner voice is not your ally. In fact, anything that stops you thinking is a good thing. So listening to stories, it does prevent that kind of analytical and self-questioning voice. So there's no place for that. Just get on with it.